Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. The Putnam County Commission is now in session. The Honorable Ben Rogers presiding. God bless the United States, the state of Tennessee, and this Honorable Commission. Chairman. Thank you, Sheriff Ferris. Uh, invocation is by uh, District 8, which is uh, Commissioner Holmes and I. He told me to go ahead and, and, and do the prayer, so if you will, just join me in prayer. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for the many blessings you've given us, Lord. We thank you for being patient with us. Uh, we ask for humility and with wisdom, Lord, as, as we do as best we can to serve you and, our, and the people of this county. Lord, always be with us. Thank you so much for everything you do for us. Keep us safe here, Lord, and keep everyone safe at home. Uh, Lord, I just thank you for everyone and their patience and everything they do for the county. They are humble servants, and we ask that we continue to be that way. In your son, Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, if everybody will join me uh, for the pledge, I will begin the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag, the flag of the United States of America, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, nation, nation under God, indivisible, liberty, and justice for Great job, great job, thank you. Um, now at this time we're going to do the roll call by County Clerk Wayne Neighbors. All right, here we go. Commissioner Williams. Present. Uh, Commissioner Christopher. I believe Commissioner Christopher is absent. Commissioner Sandlin. Here. Commissioner Martin. Here. Commissioner Awanzen Jordan. Present in the voice. Yay. Mr. Ford. Here. Commissioner Taze. Here. Commissioner Robertson. Here. Commissioner Adams. Here. Commissioner Randolph. Here. Commissioner Cassidy. Present. Commissioner Johnson. Here. Commissioner Donadio. Here. Commissioner Bennett. Here. Commissioner Holmes. Here. Commissioner Rogers. Here. Present. Commissioner Neal. Here. Commissioner Moss. Here. Commissioner Awanazan Joe. Present. Commissioner Bradford. Here. Commissioner Wilson. Here. Commissioner Dunn. Here. Commissioner Real. Here. And Commissioner Atwood. I am here, and Ben, I still have not got that uh, email. Okay, maybe it's taking a second to come through. If if not, I can we can get through it. I can help you. Um, but it, I sent it through my from my email, so I sent it to your Premier Park email. Oh. Don't have that anymore. Okay. That might be a problem. What is what's the email, Mike? Uh, DM Atwood one at Gmail. Did you get that, Ben? Say say that again for me. DM Atwood, the number one at Gmail dot com. All right, I got it. Okay, um, should be coming right now. All right, at this time, I'm going to read the language that allows us to meet electronically. We've got to put it in our uh, minutes, so I'll need a motion and a second when I finish. So let me read it, and I'll entertain a motion. Pursuant to Executive Order Number 16, issued by the Honorable Bill Lee, Governor of the State of Tennessee, on March 20th, 2020, as a reasonable measure to protect the safety and welfare of Tennesseans while ensuring that government business may continue in a manner that is open and accessible to the public, the governor has declared the provisions of the Open Meetings Act, Tennessee Code Annotated, Title 8, Chapter 44, Part 1, are suspended to the extent necessary to allow a governing body, as defined in Tennessee Code Annotated, Section 8-44-102, including the Putnam County Board of Commissioners, to meet and conduct its essential business by electronic means, Rather than being required to gather a quorum of members physically present at the same location, the Putnam County Board of Commissioners has determined that meeting electronically is necessary to protect the health, safety, and welfare of Tennesseans in light of COVID-19 outbreak. 
This meeting shall be conducted by electronic means and shall be open and accessible to the public attendance by electronic means. It is acknowledged by the Putnam County Board of Commissioners that Executive Order Number 16 does not in any way limit existing quorum or voting requirements under law. It is further acknowledged by the Putnam County Board of Commissioners that all provisions of Tennessee Code Annotated Section 8-44-108C remain in effect and this meeting shall be conducted in a manner consistent with Article 1, Section 19 of the Tennessee Constitution. This also applies to the committee meetings we just held. So I'll entertain a motion, please. Mr. Trump, what is the motion to approve? Second. Second. Any discussion on what I just read? All in favor say aye. Uh, aye. 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 Any opposed? Thank you. We've got that into our minutes, and we are now um, officially able to meet electronically. Next on the agenda is the approval of the agenda item number five. Motion to approve. Any, any discussion on the, I got a motion and second. Any discussion on the agenda? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Aye. Agenda has been approved. All right, number six, approval of the minutes of the previous meeting. Motion to approve, Cindy. Second. Second. Give me we got it. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? The minutes have been approved. Item number seven, unfinished business and action thereon by the board. A, report of standing committees, planning committee. No unfinished business. Thank you, Madam Chairman. Fiscal review committee. No unfinished business. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Nominating committee. No unfinished business. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. B, report of special committees. None that I'm aware of. Okay. C, other unfinished business. Item number eight, new business and action there on by the board. A, report of standing committees, planning committee. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Planning committee recommends approval for the sheriff's department to sell the following items VI internet slash public auction and I so move. Second, Terry Randolph. All right, I have a motion second. Any discussion? Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? That motion passes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Item B recommends approval for the technology department to sell the following items VIA internet slash public auction with two items listed and I so many. Second, second, Kathy Dunn. Second, Dunn. We have a motion a second. Any discussion on that motion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? That motion passes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Item C recommends approval to add a new section in the county personnel policy that addresses the COVID-19 virus and other emergencies, and I so move. Second. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? That motion passes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. That completes planning. Thank you, Madam Chairman. Number two, Fiscal Review Committee. Thank you, sir. Item number A, Fiscal Review recommends approval of the budget amendment to the general purpose of the fund. And I will move. Second. Second. Okay, we have a motion and a second. Any discussion on that? We will do a roll call, and the clerk is getting his paper, and I'll turn it over to him. Thank you, sir. All right. If you favor the motion, vote yes. If not favor the motion, vote no. We're going to vote as, as your name is called. Mr. Williams. Aye. Mr. Christopher is absent. Mr. Sandlin? Yes. Mr. Martin? Yes. Mr. Wanazan Jordan? Yes. Mr. Ford? Yes. 
Ms. Tays? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donatio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Uh, Mr. Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes. Mr. Moss? Yes. Mr. Wannes and Joe? Yes. Ms. Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson? Yes. Ms. Dunn? Yes. Ms. Real? Yes. And Mr. Atwood? Yes, sir. All votes are in. Anyone wish to change their vote anywhere? Mr. Chair, you have 23 voting yes, zero no, one absent when the roll was called. Motion carried. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Item B. <laughs> I recommend approval of budget amendments to the Road Department Fund, and I so move. Second. Okay. All right, we have a motion to second. Any discussion? All right, Mr. Clerk, you ready to call the roll? Please. All right. If you favor the motion, vote yes. If you're not in favor of the motion, vote no. Everyone vote when I call your name. Mr. Williams. Yes. Mr. Christopher is absent. Mr. Sandlin? Yes. Mr. Martin? Yes. Mr. Wanneson Jordan? Yes. Mr. Ford? Yes. Ms. Tays? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Richard Donatio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Chairman Rogers? Yes. Neil? Yes, sir. Mr. Moss? Yes. Mr. Wallace and Joe? Yes. Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson? Yes. Yes. Mr. Dunn? Yes. Ms. Real? Yes. Mr. Atwood. Mr. Atwood. Yes, sir. All right. It was to change their vote anywhere. Mr. Chairman, you have all 23, uh, 23 voting yes, one absent when the roll was called. Motion carries. Not in business. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Item number C, recommend physical review of Mr. Capital Projects Fund, and I so move. This is Commissioner Jordan, second. We have a motion to second. Is there any discussion? All right, Mr. Clerk, please call the roll. All right. In favor of the motion, vote yes. Do not favor the motion, vote no. When I call your name, everyone, please vote. Here we go. Mr. Williams. Yes. Mr. Christopher is absent. Mr. Sandlin. Yes. Mr. Martin. Yes. Mr. Wannison Jordan. Aye. Mr. Ford? Yes. Ms. Tays? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donatio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Mr. Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes. Mr. Moss? Yes. Mr. Awanas and Joe? Mr. Awanas and Joe? Okay, did we, did we lose him at the same time? Okay. Mr. Wannison, Joe? Joe, you still with us there? 
Hello? Did we lose Joe? Let me let me come let me try to come back to you. Miss Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson. Yes. Okay. Miss Dunn? Yes. Miss Real? Yes. Mr. Atwood. Yes, sir. All right, did we find Mr. Wanazan, Joe? Did we lose Joe? Did we lose Joe in the transmission somewhere? All right, uh, I'm going to have to mark him, huh? Negative mute button. You reckon he's got himself muted? Hey, uh, Jordan, uh, can you call your your dad and see if he's around J just for the next item? We we'll move on and. Yes, you should be able to. Do I just? Uh, I guess I can put your guys back on mute and do that. I guess. Um, that's true. I'm sorry. Does your mom have a cell phone? Can you? You might be able to text. You might be able to text him. Yeah, let me try to text real quick. Mr. Aaron, do you want me to move on? Yeah, go ahead and move on. Let me mark him. Uh, I have to mark him. Absent. I don't have a choice. Normally, we'd be abstaining. But... All right. Uh, Mr. Chairman, you have 22 yes. That makes 22 absence. Motion carries anyway. Go, go right ahead. Thank you, Mr. Stark. Item D is uh, recommends approval of the budget amendments. General fund and I so move. Second, Denadio. We have a motion, a second. Any discussion on item D? Uh, Mr. Clark, you please call the roll. All right. If you favor the motion, vote yes. If you're not favor the motion, vote no. When I call your name, here we go. Uh, Mr. Mr. Williams. Yes. Christopher's out. Mr. Sandlin. Yes. Mr. Martin. Yes. Mr. Wannes and Jordan. Aye. Mr. Ford? Yes. Ms. Taze? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donadio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Uh, Commissioner Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes, sir. Mr. Moss? Yes. All right, did we find uh, Mr. Juan is in Joe? Still trying this is to find Commissioner Joe. Jordan. This, this is Commissioner Jordan, if I could speak for just a second. Yes. Uh, he texted me back, and he said he was, for some reason, knocked off, and it's not letting him back on. Okay. Okay. Um, just asking if he's dialed the 877 number, Jordan. Yeah, absolutely. That email I sent is 502, roughly, is the one that, that gets us back in. What was that again, Ben? Sorry. The email that I sent at 502 is the one that gets us back in. I don't know if he got it or not. He, he should have. Uh, but the number is going to be 877-668-5555. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll message him and let him know that. Thank you. I'm going to count, again, have to count him absent there. Uh, let's continue on. Miss Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson? Yes, sir. Uh, Miss Dunn? Yes. Real? Yes. And Mr. Atwood? Yes, sir. All right. Mr. Chairman, you have 22 yes. Uh, absent when the vote is called. Uh, motion carried. Thank you, Item E, this is for you recommended approval to build the jail exhibition uh, in the parking lot of the existing uh, building, and I so move. Neil, second. 
So we got a we got a motion a second. Who's second? Mr. Rando? Uh I think so, yes. Motion a second. Any discussion on the motion? Yes, Commissioner Zanadio. Go ahead, Commissioner Zanadio. Okay, I feel like I'm getting a second bite at the apple on this thing, so I'm gonna enjoy it. Um, okay, so we we have the options for six months. If this passes, we are definitely building in the parking lot no matter what, correct? Am I, am I check, correct so far? I, I, I mean, definitely is a strong word, but I'm asking. I'm asking. I'm asking the question. Am I correct so far? If it, if it needs to be built, unless they change. That. I mean, well, we can change our mind, but that is the motion today. Yes. Okay. So, my if this motion passes, are we committed to building in the parking lot? So those properties. Are now, and I, I want to make sure I'm wording this correctly. I, I know what idea I'm trying to convey. It's just hard for me to to think how to word it correctly. Um, if we're com committing to building in that parking lot, um, that means, and that we have the option on these properties. The, is the purpose for committing so that we can, because there's there's other pieces of the puzzle that are moving based on that, not just the property. That's correct. Okay. I, and I, I didn't understand that in, in that term last time I asked it. And I, I apologize. I just want to make real certain because right now the future is a little uncertain. I just want to make sure I'm doing the right thing. Sure. Absolutely. Chairman Rogers, this is Commissioner Moss. Yes, sir. Go ahead, Commissioner Moss. Okay. As I'm reading E on the fiscal review, agenda here it says consider the location of the new addition to the jail and the purchase of the adjacent property are we uh is part of that don't need to be on there well yeah and that's that's where we changed it from fiscal review uh that's what i sent commissioner atwood that's why he read recommends approval to build the jail addition the parking lot of the existing facility the latter part of that was addressed by commissioner williams motion in fiscal review and that will be item g on our agenda that's been amended basically through committee so that was amended that's how the our process works um things come from committee recommended or, or not recommended but since that was a discussion item it wasn't really a motion to vote on it it, it, it was presented to us as a discussion item we were, emotions came out of that item so that's where we put the motions on and that's what i sent to commissioner atwood to read and, and dale this is jeff jones <clears throat> yes sir Given given the circumstances with this virus and the way that we're meeting right now, ordinarily there'd be a week in between the committee meetings and full commission. So so we just have to take the best step that we can as far as putting the the full commission agenda together. That's good, right. Jeff. Okay, as I understand it, then all I'm going to be voting on is consider the location of the new addition to the jail. That's correct. That's correct. Thank you, guys. Good deal. Thank you. Any more discussion from the commission? Mr. Jordan with a question and something else to bring up too. Yes, sir. Commissioner Wanderson. Uh For starters, dad said that it says commissioner or um, administrator has not arrived is the message he gets back. He's been trying to use the uh, login info from the 502 message and uh, he said administrator has not arrived is the uh, response back that he's getting. Will you will yeah. you tell him to call? Will you tell him to call Mary Porter's cell phone, please? Yes, yeah, absolutely. I will, I will do that. But uh, okay, thank you. The, uh, I just want to make a statement regarding this. I want to say uh, thank you to Mayor Porter uh, regarding the uh, the work that he's put in and the staff on trying to get these options moved out for another six months. Because uh, we all do know that the uh, Justice Center at some point does need to be expanded as soon as possible, and. Uh, we, uh, I'm definitely in support of that. I think it's a necessary thing, but at the same time with the uh, crisis we have going on hand, I've uh, talked to a couple of business folks I know, and some of the businesses that are even open, they're telling me that uh, sales are down 20 30% or more, so we know that's going to affect our uh, sales revenue, sales tax revenue coming in, as well as the uh, revenue we get from hotel motels down considerably as well. So with the budget concerns, I know a lot of folks do have concerns about the immediate uh, work on this, so I do appreciate uh, Mayor Porter with those uh, options extended that he's done, and then also the uh, voices on the fiscal committee earlier tonight that 
have encouraged us to try to talk more about this uh, at a later time when we can meet together in person. I'm, I'm thankful for those voices too at the, the fiscal committee that have allowed us to do this. Thank you, Mr. Wallace, for those comments. Any more discussion? All right, Mr. Clerk, you please call the roll. All right, ladies and gentlemen, if you favor the motion, vote yes. If you're not in favor of the motion, vote no. Everyone, uh, please vote as your name is called. Mr. Uh, Mr. Williams. Yes. All right, Mr. Christopher's absent. Mr. Sandlin. Yes. Mr. Martin. Yes. Mr. Wanazan Jordan. Yes. Mr. Ford. Yes. Ms. Tays? No. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donatio? Yes, sorry about the dogs. Oh, well, that's quite all right. Uh, Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Chairman Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes, sir. Mr. Moss? Yes. Now we have Mr. Mr. Joe hooked up here by the others. Uh, Mr. Joe, your vote, please. Yes. Thank you, sir. Ms. Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson? Yes. Ms. Dunn? Yes. Ms. Real? Yes. And Mr. Atwood? Yes, and thank you, Commissioners. Anybody wish to change your vote anywhere? All right, Mr. Chair, you have 22 voting yes. One voting no, one absent when the roll is called. Item E, uh, passes. Thank you, Mr. Clark. I appreciate it. Item F is to uh, recommend approval of an addition of the meeting room at the animal shelter with the cost of approximately 100000 as part of Ms. Ayer's $1.2 million donation. And I so move. Second. Second. Got it, Mr. Clark. Okay. We have a motion a second. Any discussion? All right, Mr. Clerk, you please call the roll. All right. Favor the motion, vote yes or not. Favor the motion, vote no. Here we go. Mr. Williams. Yes. Mr. Christopher Sampson. Mr. Sandlin. Yes. Mr. Martin. Yes. Mr. Wanazan Jordan. Yes. Mr. Ford? Yes. Ms. Tays? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Mr. Randolph? Yes. Ms. Cassidy? Yes. Yeah. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donatio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Chairman Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes. Mr. Moss? Yes. Mr. Joe Awanazan? Yes. Ms. Bradford? Yes. Ms. Wilson? Yes. Ms. Dunn? Yes. Ms. Real? Yes. Mr. Atwood. Yes. Anyone wish to change their vote? Well, Mr. Chair, you have 23 voting yes, one absent of the roll is called. Motion carries. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. And the new item G is physical review recommends deferral of the discussion on the parking lot purchases until the first meeting at which we are back together. And I so move. Second. 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 All, right. All right, we have a motion and a second. Any discussion? 
Okay, we can do a voice vote on this if it does not involve any money. Uh, and Mr. Clerk, I'll ask you just. Well, I'll just say all in favor say aye. 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 Any All right, the motion passes. And Mr. Chair, that completes the fiscal review. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Great job. Great job, everybody. Moving on to nominating committee, Chairman uh, Randolph. Uh, yes, Mr. Chairman. Nominating committee. Uh, part A recommends approval of the reappointment of Sullivan Smith, MD, as medical examiner for a two year term to expire April 2022, and I so move. Second. Second. Neil. All right, we have a motion and a second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? That motion passes. Item B, Mr. Chairman, nominating committee recommends approval of the request from Assessor of Property Steve Pierce to reappoint the following to the County Board of Equalization for two year terms to expire April 2022. Gary Bush to North, Brian Eads to East, Arlene Bush to South, Ryan Lefevre to West, and Chris Holloway an alternate, and I so move. Second, Adam. Second. Yes. We have a motion a second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion passes. That concludes nominating, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Moving on to B, report of special committees. <laughs> no special committees or resolutions. There are no resolutions, Mr. Chairman. Election notaries. All right, got a very short list tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Deborah Anderson, Jamie L. Ashburn, Angie D. Byers, Wanda K. Cox, Doris J. Driver, Melanie G. Madewell, Joshua Stites, Jenny L. Wilson, and Suzanne Woods. Motion to approve. Second. Mr. Jordan. We have a motion second. Any discussion on notaries? Mr. Clerk, you please call the roll. All right. Mr. Williams? Yes. Mr. Sandlin? Yes. Mr. Martin? Yes. Mr. Wanzen Jordan? Aye. Uh, Mr. Ford? Yes. Ms. Tays? Yes. Mr. Robertson? Yes. Ms. Adams? Yes. Uh, Mr. Randolph? Yes. Mr. Cassidy? Yes. Mr. Johnson? Yes. Mr. Donadio? Yes. Mr. Bennett? Yes. Mr. Holmes? Yes. Chairman Rogers? Yes. Mr. Neal? Yes, sir. Uh, Mr. Moss? Yes. Uh, Mr. Juanes and Joe? Yes. Ms. Bradford? Yes. Mr. Wilson? Yes. Ms. Dunn? Yes. Ms. Rio? Yes. And Mr. Atwood? Yes. Mr. Chairman, you have 23 yes, one absent. Motion carries. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Item E, other new business, recognize cash flow analysis and monthly budget to actual report for the general purpose school fund. That is being recorded into the minutes. Number two, ratification of County Mayor Randy Porter's reappointment to the Regional Solid Waste Committee for four-year term to expire 2024 as follows. Cindy Adams and Kathy Reel. Motion to approve. Thank you. Second. I have a motion second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Motion passes. Are there any announcements and statements? Commissioner Bennett has one. Yes, sir. Uh, first off, uh, I'd like to commend Mayor Porter for his years of getting us in good financial shape for hard times. And, uh, you know, I think we're heading into some hard times, especially unknown, uncertain financial times. 
as uh, Commissioner Adams and Commissioner Jordan, I want us unpointed out, our sales revenue are down. Nowhere, property tax revenue is down due to the tornado. We don't know what kind of impact the virus and the shutdown is going to have. So I'd like to caution everybody to be thinking about that as we look at spending money during this next year on how we can cut back on unnecessary spending, add more to savings until we see how this is all going to shake out so that we don't put an undue burden of property tax increase on our citizens. And again, I'd like to commend Mayor Porter and other elected officials as well as the commission for doing a good job at this point, but now it's very important that we look forward. But that's all I had to say. Thank you, Commissioner Bennett. Any other announcements and statements? I just want to say thank you all again. Uh, thank you to the ones in here with me. Uh, Mayor Porter, Jeff Jones, our county attorney, Wayne Neighbors, our county clerk, Sheriff Ferris, and, and Major Nash. Uh, this can't be possible without them helping me in their IT department. So hope you all have a good week. Hopefully next month we'll be in person and see each other. We can do this like we normally do. Do I have a motion to adjourn? Motion to adjourn. Thank you all.